How's it going guys, Jacob here. Today we're gonna check out the Polymax synth from Universal Audio. The Polymax pulls from the golden age of synthesis. We're talking about sounds from the Jupiter, Oberheim, legendary synths that were on legendary hit songs. The Polymax is truly a combo of retro and modern, and you can get some fat, rich sounds with this plugin. But before I get started, I want to let you know that for the first time ever, this is really cool, these plugins will work in any major DAW with any audio interface and it's available to purchase individually. This goes for a whole collection of UA plugins, which includes mixing and mastering tools, virtual instruments, and more. So if you want to check those out, click the link in the description below. Let's take a quick look at the plugin. Of course, you get analog modeled oscillators and filters. You have oscillator one and two here, a full filter section, simple intuitive controls. This is a plugin I think that the beginner could easily learn how to start using and dive into quickly, but also the advanced user will feel at home. And it's because everything is labeled so clearly, it's not too busy as an interface. It's all very, I mean, filter, LFO, envelope, amplifier, your FX at the bottom, everything is just really clear and it's easy to use. You also get studio quality effects with this plugin, including vintage spring reverb, tape delay, and modulation textures. You can see here delay, spring, and hall. I'm gonna show you those, they sound really nice. Easy way to start morphing your sound into something you love and especially if you start with a preset, you can use these FX to tweak it and personalize it even more. Let's check out some presets. You start with default sound. I've got a MIDI controller here, so I'm gonna play a little for you. Now I'm using the mod wheel here, and the wheel section is down here, so you have your pitch bend amount. So now it's just up a whole step, but can do a whole octave. Really easy to change, again, those simple controls. The mod wheel, two options, vibrato and cutoff, which you can change there, and here's where you change the amount. I like to use it, especially when I'm doing a lead sound with the pitch bend and then the mod to give just a little bit of that vibrato effect. The plugins are organized in categories. You have poly. Here's a few poly sounds. Bass, a lot of really good bass sounds in here. <laughs> yeah, I can totally hear that. Lead sounds. Oh, man, there's some really fat, epic leads. Hey, look, epic. And this one has the arpeggiator on. You can change the rate, make it faster. Nice. FX. That's making a nice use of the arpeggiator there. Oh, 
Ah, so this has a lot of sound design effects potential to it as well. Drums. That's nice. So you could really just use this plugin to add a lot of layers to your tracks. Let's check out horns. That's brass. Now that's a classic sound. Let's add some reverb to it, a little effect. So we can do some delay. or spring reverb. You can change the time to be long or short. Or hall reverb. Well, that's really wide. I like that. I can hear it spreading a little bit more. You can EQ from low to high. Yeah, let's try some of that with a different sound. Yes. Let's try some plucked sounds. These are pretty. Let's try bells. Spooky. <laughs> wow. I like the best of category they've included. That one's been fun for me to get inspiration when I've used this plugin and tracks I'm working on. Some really nice ones in here. <laughs> nice. And look, I just played that. That was just messing around, being inspired by a sound in the moment. And that's what it's all about. That's why this plugin is great. These presets already give you some inspiration, take you in one direction. And you can go retro, you can go modern, and you can't go wrong. And that's the Polymax synth. If you've got any questions, put those in the comments below. Remember to like, subscribe, click here for more videos like this one, and go to sweetwater.com for all of your music instrument and pro audio needs. That's good. Look at my eye twitching. <laughs>